Good afternoon, everyone, and happy Friday. It, this is Miss Louisa, and it's time to get our stem on. Today, I have a fun science project to share with you. It's called Walking Water Paper Towel Experiment, and you can do it with materials you have access to at home. You will need three paper towels, six cups, ideally the same size, and red, yellow, and blue food coloring. And of course, water. So, what you'll do is, first you'll get one of them, I'm doing red, and I'm gonna get one of my cups, they're little, but they can be any size. I'm gonna put five drops, one, two, three, four, Five. I'm putting it back. Make sure to close all lids. I'm going to get my next color, blue. And I'm going to put five drops. One, two, three, four, five. And now my last color, yellow. And how many drops? Five. One, two, three, four, five. And you can add more if you want a, a stronger color. It's entirely up to you. So now I'm going to get my water and I'm going to put water in only the glasses that have the food coloring. So I'll do yellow first. So now is when you decide, oh, is that enough? Or should I put more color? So it's yellow, red, and blue. So now take your paper towels. I didn't have any paper towels, so I'm using napkins. Didn't get to the store before they became a priceless object. You could probably try to do this with other things. Toilet paper, if you have 10,000 rolls, but you're gonna fold it into, like, you're gonna roll it until it's about like an inch wide. So I'm going to do this here, then you're going to stick, let's fold it in half, you're going to stick one end in a cup that has water and one end in a cup that does not. And do the same thing with the other two. And then, so this one here, I'm going to stick in the yellow and the empty one with the end. All right, and let's keep doing this. until you have one going from each color into an empty cup. And then, well, you want to wait, oh, at least a little, depending on the material, anything up to an hour, and then come and check the results and take, you can take them out. I'd love to see what your results are. So, as always, stay safe, wash your hands, and don't forget to have some fun.